Hi, welcome to the newest version of the Knack Builder. We're excited to show you around. This update adds new features, improvements to existing features, and creates a foundation for additional features and improvements going forward. So what's new in the new builder? For starters, clear navigation. A clean navigation along the side with schema, previously called objects, records, pages, and tasks. Here you can also find your settings, no longer hidden behind another menu. When working with your records, you can also find quick access to edit and add fields directly without having to navigate back to your schema. Here you can now add field descriptions for easy reference later while building your app. Other updates for records include an improved import process, drag and drop your file to upload records, easier mapping to columns in your spreadsheet, and create new fields with specific field types. We also improved the equation editor to add more clarity with a larger text window, drop downs to browse functions and fields, and improve clarity when selecting connected fields. On image fields, you can now enable imagery sizing when images are uploaded, allowing you to ensure images are a web-friendly size and reduce overall storage in your app. In the Pages section, when editing your pages and views, you can now find all settings in the toolbox to the left. The toolbox will display settings for whichever page or view you're working on, so you can now view your settings side by side with your page preview while you're building. When building pages, flexible layouts are now supported. You can drag and drop your views into one, two, or three columns. Further, we have improved the process to create child pages, with no limit to the types of views or how many can be added. Adding new views to a page is now much more intuitive, with the process broken down into simple steps. When adding views displaying connected records, the language has been simplified, making it much clearer to select the correct connection when you have many to choose from. When editing these views, all edits are now immediately visible in the page preview so you can make multiple edits in the view settings in the toolbox and immediately see how it looks in real time in the page preview. Additionally, you can now expand and collapse all views in your page preview, making it easier to navigate your pages while building and maintaining your app. You can also add internal page names in the page preview for easy reference in the builder. When editing views, you can now add and remove all fields at once rather than one at a time for quick view updates. In table views specifically, inline editing now allows for filtering connection lookups. This means you can filter what users see in the live app while editing connection fields directly in a table. Further, inline editing now supports record rules. This means inline editing on a table view can trigger rules that update the record being edited, inserts or updates a connected record, or sends a custom email. In addition to expanding record rules to inline editing, Rule options have also been expanded. Rule actions can now append or remove values from multiple choice or connection fields without overriding the existing values. These rule actions are available on conditional rules, scheduled tasks, record rules, and action links. Further, record rules now includes a has changed filter, allowing you to trigger record rules when the value of a field has changed. You can also get more precise by defining when a field has changed to or from a specific value. Above all else, this update creates a strong foundation behind the scenes, allowing our team to take feedback and rapidly apply it as product improvements going forward. You can follow along with upcoming updates and the latest releases on our What's New page. You can access this page, along with other resources, from our new Help menu. As always, if you have any questions, reach out to us in the Messenger in the Builder or email us at support at Until next time, happy building!